Good evening. In this video, I'll be talking about random walk model and its testing. So let's start. Random walk model says that the price changes in individual security is independent. As per the theory, the past movement or trend of a stock price cannot be used to predict its future movement. If a stock price follows random work model, forecasting a set's price would be useless. Random work is said to have an infinite memory. It means the impact of particular shock does not die away. Any security market follows random work model. It means technical analyst or fundamental analyst cannot be capable to generate abnormal return. Let's understand with this example. Yt is today price. Yt minus is yesterday price and plus error term. So if I just if I difference make a difference between today price and a stock price, it becomes error term, which is also known as change in price. So this change in price or error term has to be independent. If any stock price follows random work model. There are so many tests which can be applied to test the random work model like run test, stationarity test, serial correlation test, variance ratio test and others. I will be talking about run test and variance ratio test in this video. Well, this is a series of nifty 50 and uh, I will be applying variance ratio test and run tests. So first I'll be talking about uh, variance ratio test. Well, as we know, R is more suitable for packages. That's why it is said package is a strength of R studio. For variance ratio test, there is package which is known as VR test. First and foremost, we have to install VR test and upload it in library. I have already installed VR tests. So I'm going to upload it or store it in library. So what I write here, library VR test, enter. Well, after writing this, the command for VR test is VR test and auto queue, then series name. What is our series name? The information given is of nifty and from that nifty i have calculated return on nifty then i just write here r nifty so what i write here return on nifty and then press on enter let's read the p value is 0 0.1507. It means the p value is more than 5%. So, what is null hypothesis of variance ratio test? The null hypothesis for variance ratio test in R is the return on Nifty. It means R Nifty follows randomness or random work model. And our hypothesis, 
our p value is 0.15 it means more than 5% hence our null hypothesis fails to reject and we can say that return on nifty follows randomness or random walk model let's talk about another test for testing the random walk model that is run test for run test first and foremost we have to install package and that is rand tests after installing this i have to just store in library so i write here library r a n d rand tests and press on enter well for run test we have to store the value in model 1 equal to lm which is linear model and return on nifty that is r nifty on the basis of 1 so here 1 is nothing but constant so just press on enter now model 1 has been created in which there is a storage of linear model of return on nifty on the basis of constant after writing this i simply write here run runs test and then model 1 symbol of dollar and residuals so what is command simple the command is runs dot test model 1 and uh, symbol of dollar residuals just press on enter this is the result derived from runs test in r like uh, this is t statistic minus 1.08 these are runs 877, N1, 899, N2, 899, N equal to 1798. P value is 0 0.2779. So what is the hypothesis? The hypothesis for run test is return on Nifty follows randomness or random walk model our p value is more than 5% so what we can say we can say that the null hypothesis fails to reject hence the series of return on nifty follows random walk model that is all about how to test random walk model in R. Thank you very much.